Everybody, this is Brother Paxton coming to you from Medora, North Dakota. Let's make a proclamation together, shall we? Let's talk about servanthood today. Let's make a confession of faith, uh, declaring what the Word of the Lord has said to us about servanthood. I serve the Lord with gladness, for I am His handiwork, recreated in Christ Jesus, to do the good works He has planned for me to do. Hallelujah. I want to serve you, Lord, with passion. Now think, you know, you know how prosperous you become if you could do your job with passion? Wow. As I allow God's light to shine through my good deeds, my God will be glorified. In both service and spiritual worship, I dedicate my body as a living sacrifice, holy, devoted, and well-pleasing to God. I work heartily at every task, for I am actually serving the Lord when I minister to others. In kindness and mercy, I do justice to the weak, poor, and fatherless. With love in my heart, I submit my time, talents, and energies to be used by God in ministering to the needs of others, according to his leading. God sends favor and blessing to me, providing all that I need to finish every good work in abundance. I cling to God, wholly conforming to his example, as I serve others in his name. Praise the Lord. When I'm tired and I'm tempted to lose heart, I come close to you, O oh Lord. O oh Lord Jesus, and you renew my strength. You enable me to run without growing weary, to walk without becoming faint. I thank God for giving me the strength and ability to serve others, for judging me and counting me faithful and trustworthy, putting me into the ministry, and I arm myself with the Word of God that I might be equipped for every good work. I set myself apart from corrupt and unclean influences. Thus, I am a useful vessel, consecrated and profitable to the Master, ready and fit to fulfill His will and purpose. Praise God. Now that's what the Word of God has to say about my servanthood and your servanthood as unto the Lord. Amen. You know, God has appointed you to be a servant. He's appointed His children to serve others in His name. You can be victorious in that. And you need to make this proclamation. I hope you're taping this program so you can watch these over and over and over again. And you can see what the Word has to say. So today, tomorrow, if you're getting this at night, as you go out to serve others in His name, keep these words in the midst of your heart. And do what you do as unto the Lord. And he will prosper you. He will bless you. We're in the middle of some crisis times right now. But God's blessing will be yours if you'll put these principles to work in your life. Amen. God bless you.